einem neuen FIFA Mobile Stream von mir, dem Konsti. Äh, schau noch kurz, ob jetzt hier eh auch alles passt von den Einstellungen. Kurz Moment, auf Twitch am Notebook wird mir noch nichts angezeigt. Ich werde mal <lacht> neu starten. So, mal alle technischen Voraussetzungen hier mal erfüllen. Ja, passt. Schaut gut aus. Wir sind live. Okay, grüß euch. Ähm, steigen wir mal ein. Heute Dienstagabend, circa eineinhalb Stunden nach Reset. Wir haben das Ligaturnier verloren. Wieder sehr, sehr bitter. Äh, da tun wir leider ein bisschen underperformen in letzter Zeit. Was gibt's Neues? Bonuseinstieg. Ja, die 1760 Vorteilspunkte für die letzte Niederlage ist bitter. Wir verlieren gefühlt 3 von 4 äh, LBL in letzter Zeit. Drei Frostköder, das ist das tägliche Login-Geschenk heute am Tag 35 Skillboosts. Skillboosts sind gut. Box to Box ist sehr gut. Schauen wir mal. Box to Box haben wir. Und können wir auch leveln. Wir werden auch heute Skillboosts leveln. Ähm so, Chat ist aktiviert, Notebook ist aktiviert. Äh, fangen wir mal an mit Freeze Event. Äh, machen wir dann die Market Claims, wir werden Skillboost upgraden, wir werden den täglichen Grind machen, CPU-Spiel eventuell werde ich auch machen. Wir können auch den Piero heute holen, wir hätten wir eigentlich schon auch letzten Stream machen können. Äh, werden wir auch machen. Also fangen wir mal an mit der Schneeflocke, wie immer, damit wir da die Energie runterspielen. Und sehen dann, wie sich der Stream entwickelt. Uh, hello, welcome everybody to my stream here. Second stream in the year 2022. I hope you guys all have a happy new year. Um, I have just now entered the game about one and a half hours after reset. Uh, we're going to start off as usual with the daily snowflake just to not have any energy issues here. Uh, grind freeze event, uh, grind daily division rivals, uh, get some mark claims, do some upgrades with skill boosts, perhaps some upgrades with the team. Um, yeah, and we'll see how the how the stream develops. So box shooting here uh, uh, too high. Yeah, it was too high. I tapped, I swiped too quickly here. Okay, interesting. I don't think we ever had this with a, a long white box here. Nevertheless, easy. So we'll get some town points here, village points. Um, I'm gonna claim some rewards on the node in the winter section uh, to go for the second now and later 115 player, the right forward guy. Forgot his name, but... He's gonna be the next uh, now and later player that I'm gonna claim. Uh, I'm thinking of getting the third offer from the Flash Seal back pack, um, 50,000 more skill boosts. Uh, we'll see how that goes. We're gonna upgrade some skill boosts. We're gonna upgrade our team. Gonna do some daily grinds. See if people pop by in the chat. Um, yeah, looking forward to a nice chilled, relaxing stream here. So, scenario should be quite easy. I think we just need one shot here, yeah. One shot and it's done and dusted. As we move on to the Star Steel games here. So, another shooting uh, skill game here. Ah, it's with the targets, yeah, okay. The targets don't turn around, so that's gonna be quite easy. Always go for the light targets, they give you more points. As there aren't any at the moment, but that should be okay. Bottom left here. Easy skill games, shouldn't be a big challenge for you guys. Just make sure to grind the entire snowflake to, to maximize your village points and to claim the rewards then in the in the winter node yeah we already have three stars not even having to hit the last target here and having extra time nevertheless 12,800 points I think my record was 13,000 so we're close to that I have three stars here with ease um, 
Next one is Coin Runner, all right. Okay, at least it's the harder version of Coin Runner, which does give us a bit more of a challenge. And I just see I don't have my main team activated. Um, I think this is my team for the Icon Strike points. We can collect those. I think I've gotten all of the Icon Strike requirements uh, already for this week as they do reset on Thursday. We're going to check that out. But this is my Western uh, Europe team, I think, that's activated for all of the Icon Strike points here. Oh, there we go, 13,100. We already got the six stars, but we're going to do the third skill game here for the rest of the village points as the Aurora Pass quest is completed here. We got 5,000 skill boosts today in his login, which is nice. We are going to upgrade some skill boosts after I claim the market sales. Ah, okay, I have to actually kind of concentrate on this one with the snowballs. One of the more challenging... Um, Skill games here, just dodge the snowballs, run into the circles. I think sometimes I actually only do get two stars on this if I don't really focus. But even if we only get one star, it doesn't matter. We already... Ah, I ran out. We already have two times three stars from the other skill games, so it shouldn't be a problem here. Nevertheless, I do like to get a perfect score of nine stars uh, if it, that's possible, as we are kind of colliding here with snowballs nevertheless uh, do get three uh, stars here with ease 13,500 so we increased our gameplay here from every skill game 12,800 13,100 13,500 as we have finished the snowflake here and let's just go into the daily quest rewards here and pick up the the items and the points and the daily points, the, the gems. So let me just check. I haven't been online for most of the day. Quite a bit busy in, in real life. Let me just check. I think we can already claim the the free pass here, uh, the free pack for, for gems. Yeah. So I'm going to do that and I'm just going to quickly watch the ads. Uh, as I do want to get as many uh, perk points as possible, seeing that we are kind of struggling at league matchups and I'm, I'm not really getting as much, uh, <clears throat> sorry, as much perk points as I was hoping. Nevertheless, uh, perk points reset it today. We're just going to quickly watch this ad. Perk points reset it today, so I'm going to go claim the 8,000 skill boost and the legendary shards and probably also coins and epic shards, seeing that the season is going to only run for another 2-3 weeks. There's only probably going to be two, maybe three resets of this. Um, that's why it's wise to go all in here with the with the perk points. No need to, to save up on those anymore at this time of the season. Uh, we get the perk points here. And let me check. Beckham is going to reset in 48 hours, so Thursday evening. We've done all of the requirements here except for training a player. And I was thinking let's actually train up Beckham. Yeah, this is my Western Europe team for the Icon Strike points. Uh, let's just um, go into our players and upgrade Beckham uh, to 118 because we can. Let's go all in here. 4 million coins. Uh, that puts us down to... 2.8 million, but we have market claims that we can get. Uh, let's just claim all of the Beckham stuff here in order to max that out. And we can also already go all in with Beckham here. Okay, we can't upgrade him to 119 yet, but we should be able to do that next week then. So by the end of the season, we should have Beckham at 120. Let's go back to the requirements here. Yeah, we got our free pack from the shop. And uh, I can watch the ad later. That's not a problem until reset. Um, we are then going to obviously get the second pack here, 60 and 100 points. As soon as we have 100, I'm going to claim both and then spend those points in the star pass uh, for skill boosts. 
but let's let's just finish grinding out uh, the freeze event here. As we probably have enough, yeah, we have 2,100 village points, so let's just keep going down the node here as we can claim coins. Um, 1,400. We also obviously have to go this node here to get the 115 player. That's my minimum goal is to, at the end of the event, get the now and later 115 player for the 20 ranks for my team. Uh, here we get some more skill boosts, which is nice. And let's also try to get more coins here. 715 here, and how much do we need here? 780. 780, we we're five short, but we can claim some coins. Okay, so we did spend our village coins. We're going, like I said, for the 150 players and all of the extras then for the 99 plus packs as we are gonna try to claim as many players here. Ideally, Mbappé for the 18 ranks. Um, and yeah, let's see if there are, if, if there's anything interesting in the fishing section here today. Indeed, there are 750 village points. So as soon as we get the village points, uh, we are going to then stop fishing. XP is nothing that we really need. We get our lure back. As you see, I still have 136 lures, so... Uh, it does make sense now to start going for all of the daily um, rewards that you want if you have enough lures because like I said the event's running another like two weeks. Um, so if you have enough lures then make sure that you claim as many uh, catchable days as you as you want and as you need. Village points, now and later points, snowball points obviously the most important. Um, skill boost also quite... Uh, quite good to get them. Hey Notivir, what's up? How are you doing? Happy New Year. Yeah, it's been a while. Welcome to my stream. So I just started the stream 10-15 minutes ago. You didn't really miss out on much. Uh, we just started now with the freeze event. We grinded the snowflake and now we are... We spent some village points in the winter section, in the day section. Okay, we get our player, DiMarco, which is quite good because we can use him as training XP for Trippier. Uh, as soon as I get the village points, I will quit for today, the fishing, trying to save up the lures then for the next days and weeks. Because 200,000 XP, it's not really worth them to, to get. Maybe we get the 200,000 XP before, who knows. But as soon as we get the village points, we will stop fishing. So some coins. Ideally, we want to get lures back every time. Okay, lure and scrap ticket, that's decent. Everything's alright, thank you. I was just quite busy in real life, that's why I'm not having that much time to stream. I'm still trying to stream two, three times a week, but... Uh, this is basically the first time I'm logging in today in the game. You'll see that in my inbox messages. I have like 900 messages of mainly players that are dismissed. Um, haven't been grinding the game as much as I wanted to uh, in the last days. But but yeah, I'm still trying to get regular content on, on stream here. On stream. I hope everything's fine with you too. That you have a happy new year. And everything's going well. So we have to be patient here in the thin ice for the catch of the day. Nevertheless, obviously the best option here, fishing in the thin ice, because you get scrap tickets back, you get lures back. And uh, we are almost at 1,200, I think, soon uh, in the milestone, 1,200 lures. School started for you, so you're taking a break from most games. Yeah, makes sense. Academics is important, especially during times of school. Uh, makes sense that you're taking a break. And to, to be honest, I, I've noticed many people are kind of taking a break from FIFA Mobile. Uh, the season is kind of 
coming to an end now, uh, slowly and quietly, kind of. Uh, I've noticed also the, the, the streaming content, also from the big streamers like FHS or Ruben. I mean, Ruben, in fact, actually is online now, but uh, they, they're also not streaming as, as much as they used to. Um, which just shows kind of that the air is out at, at the moment of the season. But I reckon once FIFA Mobile 22 releases in like 2-3 weeks, that streaming content from, from everybody will increase again. So my goal here is to definitely get the village points before we're down to 100 lures. I mean, we do get scrap tickets which we then can trade in for lures. But I really don't want to go under 100. So if I get the, the village points before 100, that would be great. Nevertheless, I, I hope you had a nice uh, Christmas vacation. Uh, XP, at least we get our lure back. Come on, where are the village points? Give me the village points. Maybe now at 114. Skill boost, always good. Maybe now at 113. Come on, let 13 be the lucky number here for the village points. Nope, scrap ticket. Scrap ticket. Okay, so our patience is put on a test here. Lure and scrap ticket, that's all right. Coins. Skill boost, always good. Come on, man, where are the village points? Scrap ticket. Scrap is crap. Coins and lure, okay. Hey Amin, what's up? How are you doing? Okay, we get the XP. I'd rather have the village points, but now at least we get all of the catch of the days for today. Come on, man. Give me the village points before 100. You need my help? Go ahead. What what do you need? How can I help you? I need help from EA. I need to get the village points at ASAP. You decided you want to rebuild your team? Okay. We can look at your team then afterwards if you want. Maybe I can give you some suggestions and improvements. Scrap tickets. If I'm at 100, I'm going to trade in the scrap tickets that we've collected here. I don't really want to go under 100. It's kind of a, an, a mark where I don't really want to slip under. You have too many attackers. There's no good midfielders. I mean, to be honest, there are some good midfielders. Um, Goretzka is a very good midfielder. If you check Goretzka out on renders, he's even actually slightly better than Henderson at the 120. Plus, he's fairly cheap. Okay, we're at 98, so I'm gonna just now get some scrap tickets here. We got 42, okay, that means we can get 10 more lures here. As we're gonna trade these in and we're gonna be back to 108. And then hopefully within the next eight lures, we're going to get our village points. I mean, I am going to go as long as I get the village points. You want a good link too. Okay. What's, what's your chemistry now?
Yeah, once once we finished here getting the village points, we can take a look at your team. Uh, we're gonna also claim our market sales. I'm expecting 20 to 30 million coins. We're gonna do some skill boost upgrades. Uh, but I just want to get uh, over with the f freeze event for for just so it's done and dusted with. So one more lure, okay. Okay, back at 108 lures. Hey, the boy T, what's up? How are you doing? Welcome to my stream. Perfect. There they are. See, that's all you have to do. Just go to the scrap section and um, trade some scrap tickets into lures as we now have all three... Um, Catch of the days, and how far are we away from 1,200? Not that far. We need 35 more lures, which we will get the next days to get the 50 now and later points. How many do we have? 310. That's decent. Free to play, obviously, because I'm not buying any from the passes. So, uh, Amy, we'll take a look at your team in a second. Let's just see. I think Aurora Pass were actually done already, or? Aurora Pass, yeah. We, everybody, if, if you guys grinded uh, efficiently and well, then you should be done with Aurora Pass here and claimed Wambisaka. I think I claimed him two or three days ago already. Um, season, pre-season pass. Uh, I think, yeah, we can get 10 legendary shards today, but I still have to get 100 points. Um, finally, yeah, I got it. So, Amin, let's take a look at your team. I think you are in my friends list as Amin, like I remembered last time. Uh, are you online, buddy? Yeah, you're here. Perfect. So let's take a look at your team here. 163.12 is your main team, I reckon, or? This is your main team. Let's take a look. Okay, it looks nice. 4-5-1 formation. Good head-to-head -head team. I'm, I'm seeing. I mean, Ronaldo, Buffon, Bale, Lewandowski. Uh, very nice. Maybe you want to switch to 4-4-2, seeing that you have two strikers. Um, Bisaka is okay. Varane, Bonucci. Interesting. Let's take a look. I mean, Bonucci pace 115. There are some better cards out there. Um, Jordi Alba is okay. You got Mbappé and Lewandowski in midfield. So, I, I suggest get Goretzka from the market. He's fairly cheap and he's a very good card. Get Goretzka as a central midfielder. Um... Yeah, you just need some, some midfielders here. You like this formation? Okay, yeah, I think it's a good formation too. 4-5-1 looks decent. Um, Bale and Son are left wingers that you have in right in, in midfield, the left and right midfield. For head-to-head, -head it's okay. Uh, for versus attack, you do want to make sure that you have players in position. Uh, just get players in position, get some uh, central midfielders, uh, keep working on your skill boost also work on your rank ups i just see that you have bale varan ronaldo and alba and bisaka ranked up but the other players still need ranks yeah you don't play versus attack yeah uh, i also only play versus attack for for the daily stuff uh, the the minimum requirements just to get the uh the daily gift here so if you see versus attack here we can we can check this out uh, in the weekly leaderboard, I'm only on position 300 and something. But I do at least do uh, three wins per day just to get the weekend league ticket and the coins and the XP here. Uh, you should get Goretzka, definitely. He's a, he's a great uh, central midfield card and I think he's quite cheap. You should be able to get him for like somewhere between 5 and 10 million, card, uh, 10 million coins. We can see how much he's going for actually. Uh, Goretzka, I think he's a 116. Is he a 114 or? Yeah, he's 114, I think. Why can't I find him? Why can't I find Goretzka? Is he 112? Ah, okay, he's 112, yeah. He's 112, but if you check out his stats on renders, he is a very good card. Uh, I think you can get him under, let's say, 7 million. Yeah, look, you can snipe him even for like 2.3 million here, if you can see if you're lucky. 
Um, actually, this card is actually a good farming card. If you can snipe him for 2.3 and sell him for like... He's, he's selling for 5 million, even for 6.3. There are There is still opportunities to make coins with him. Uh, we have to go up with the price in order to see a free card where we can uh, review him and his stats. Uh, take a look at him. Uh, all around nice stats, 133 pace, 130 shooting, 136 passing, box to box skill boost, which is great. I use it myself. I'm gonna upgrade uh, box to box here today also in stream. Agility 134, even a good defensive rate with 128, uh, 127 physicals here, sprint speed, shot power, um, is maxed out, long pass, short pass, vision maxed out, dribbling maxed out, and uh, all around nice stats. Uh, and if you upgrade him like to 120, I'm sure that uh, long shot is maxed out, ball control would be maxed out, um, strength would also probably be close to 140, so yeah, definitely a good card and, and cheap to get, so uh, would definitely improve your midfield. Um, let me just check up on the chat minimum yeah minimum like i said uh, he was going for 2.3 million it depends on your market obviously but uh like i said let's go to our main team if i wouldn't be playing with bullet or henderson then i would play with goretzka and to be honest uh, goretzka at 120 uh his total stats are slightly higher than henderson's i think he has one like 14 or 16 more total stats than than henderson um Okay, so let's continue. Uh, as you guys know, the uh, perk section here uh, has updated today, the, the rewards here. Uh, we have almost 50,000 perk points, not quite as many as I was hoping for because we did have a pretty poor run in league matchups. I think from the last seven league matchups, we lost like five or something. We're, we got unlucky with matchups and... Uh, it's, it, it does make a difference because we, for a loss we get like 1,760 and for a win you get 4,400. Uh, nevertheless, let's get the 8,000 skill boosts here and let's get the legendary shards. As in this time of the season, seeing that there are probably only going to be two more resets here, uh, we're going to go all in with the perk points. There's no more reason to save those. As we can upgrade three, sk four skill boosts already. Uh, you can see at the moment I only have uh, not even five million coins, but we are going to claim our market sales. I am hoping for like 20 to 30 million coins there. Uh, just dumping my, my inventory, my stock of cards. Uh, we should have like 100, 150 sales here. Uh, we're gonna go through that in a second. As I do have like over 900 uh, messages inbox, but most of them are dismissed. Because I wasn't uh, in game today. Uh, the last time I think was like... I did check out in the morning like 12 hours ago. Uh, I was in game just like for, for half an hour or something. But I didn't list anything. So we'll, I'm going to have to list quite a few cards after stream again. Go for legendary shards. Uh, let's just go all in here with our perk points. Um, what else can we get? Uh, let's get... Uh, let's get some some shards here epic shards and let's get some coins You're facing a lot of people building one team challenge, okay at the end of the season Yeah, I mean many people just at the end of the season because there's nothing much to do just to make some theme teams or favorite teams um, and, and train those up so 1400 okay um, Skill boost we can upgrade box to box, goalkeeper, long shot, and tackling. But we are gonna have to claim our coins. As you can see here, we got some sales here. Uh, I'm gonna go through them in detail. I'm not gonna dismiss all of the cards now because it would kick me out of the game, I think. Uh, I would have more. Okay, we got some league uh, presence here, which is good for league matchups. Yeah, we get some league matchups energy. Uh, we can talk about league matchups in a second. I think I did make top 10 uh, last, and these are all the silvers, yeah. So those were the sales till then. I'm just going to scroll through quickly if anything else sold. Yeah, we have another 103 card here that's sold. Um, 
Anything else? Silvers. Yeah, basically all of the silver still that I have to... I mean, I'm only listing them for like 20, 30k and they're still not going out. So I might even have to go down with the price here. Um, one more card sold here. Another silver. Okay, nothing special. But no real sales here. As Okay, we do have more sales here. Ivan. Um, another 106 cards. Some more. Okay, we get perk points here as a, as a gift, which is good. Yeah, some, some more uh, legendary and master cards down here. Uh, and we finished, yeah, we finished 8th uh, last week in league matchups with 45 cups. I was going for top 3, but again, unnecessary draws against weaker opponents. We just got quite unlucky here. Let's just claim this one eleven player that we can relist. And let's go through in detail here and see what cards sold. Um... Hello Ryan Chef 2000, welcome to my stream. Anybody know the exact date of when the new season is releasing? Uh, probably like around January 22nd to 25th. There hasn't been a um, official release date and day yet uh, from EA Sports, but just check on FIFA Mobile Twitter for for news in, in those regards. They will definitely. Um, uh, give us information in, in time. So, uh, here, fishing cards are going to run out in six hours or so. I'm going to have to relist those. You can see I've went down with my listing price, 700, 750k for 103, 104 players, not selling at the moment. But here, uh, sales do start. We sold a shape shifter card here from League Matchups for 7.5 million. Some silvers, some uh, an elite card here, gold, silvers. Couple Musialas for 800, 850k. Team of the Week, 250 and Division Rival cards. I'm basically listing um, elite cards for 200k, 200k, gold cards for 250 to 200k. Obviously, much less than, than I used to in the past. Sometimes they spiked up into millions. But at this time of the season, since I still have like over 1,500 cards uh, in my inventory, I'm just listing them for dumping prices just to get rid of them uh, as, as a stock. Couple Fernandos here for up to 400k. Saleh here, Mastercard Gold. Base card here, Romagnoli 200k. Many division rival silver still. You can still make some farming uh, profits here. Base gold cards here, 65k, 27k. Uh, division rival card here, 200k. Team of the week cards here, 250k. Uh, more division rival master cards here, which I basically is kind of a farming price, 200k. I mean, I sniped them for under 100k and just listing them for two times the price. More golds and silver cards here. Uh, here even a bronze card, but only 8,000. Um, it's it's the same sales and cards uh, basically every week. Yeah, it's silvers, division rival golds, masters, legendary cards here. A couple piatics for 650k. Um, yeah. Just getting rid of stock here. Uh, next season is going to be divided based by region. Exactly. Next season is going to be divided by seven regions, which is unfortunate. Um, what region in the world am I from? I'm going to be playing in Western Europe. Austria is going to be divided into Western Europe. Um, as we are going through my sales. Guys, I would appreciate if you would make an educated guess of how many coins we are going to claim. We are at 5.7 million now. Uh, I am hoping for at least like 30 million coins. Uh, everything under that would be bad. Everything over that would be good. As we do still need to upgrade our skill boosts here. Uh, more division rival cards here. Munir. Uh, rivalries card for 500, 450k. Couple legendaries here. 650, 800k. 98 Martinelli, 400k. And here the, the dismiss card starts. So let's go back now and just claim all of the... Uh, sales here we are at 5.7 million so ideally I want to be at like 30 to 40 million coins that would be quite nice as it's gonna take a few minutes now to claim all of the sales here <laughs> 45 to 50 million okay that would be great that would be awesome <laughs> 
seeing that these are the um, claims from basically the last stream. When was the, I think I streamed last time was on on the first, like three days ago, I think. Yeah, January first on uh, Saturday was my last stream. So these are all of the sales from from last Saturday. Although I have to say, and as you can see, a lot of dismiss cards in there. I wasn't that active on the market and with listing as I was uh, hoping for or as I actually was planning on seeing that uh, I also had uh, real life issues going on and I'm just not having that much time uh, in game at the moment to, to grind. You cleaned your entire club and you only got starting squad, okay? So you're you're basically done with investing for for the year, because I do I still suggest that you would do some farming to just upgrade your OVR and your um, your training. You could you could train players to to 120. It's gonna be quite costly, so you're still gonna want to make some coins on that. And the the best way to make coins at the moment is just master farming at the at this time of the season. John201130, hello, willkommen in my stream, welcome to my stream, John201130. So servers are a little slow at the moment. And don't worry, as you see here, 870 messages, they are not all sales. I reckon we sold around 100 to 150 cards. Um, most of them are dismissed, but I am not going to clear them because it would just kick me out of the game. As you guys all know, 1,200 is the limit that you can have in your inventory. Everything over 1,200 locks you out. And I still think I have like over 1,500, 1,600 cards. So yeah, I'm just gonna have to relist. And if they don't sell the cards, I'm just gonna have to go down with the prices. Especially with silvers, I still have a huge bulk of silver cards that I am actually listing for a much lower price than I used to. Yeah, I mean, I remember months ago I was able to sell silvers for over 100k. I think my highest silver sell was like 270k per card at, at some times in the months, uh, some time of the season there where, where we had market crashes. But those, the big times of making huge coins with market crash, with, with um, what was the one event with the... Uh, requirements for, for leagues and positions that you needed. I think it was uh, Flashback, yeah. Flashback was a huge, huge way to make money back in the days. I think that's also like six months ago or something, even more. So as you can see, a lot of division rival gold cards. I've listed for like 200 to 300k here. Uh, we should be coming to to an end here quite soon. Um, yeah, those 98 cards. Yeah, exactly. Those were the last. As I do have to scroll scroll through because some cards did sell here uh, from the dismissed ones since today in the morning. I think the the silver cards ran out like. 10 to 12 hours ago and um, we still had some sales here like a yeah 103 card here just gonna quickly scroll through you can easily see them if they're green that they they did sell um, any more here further down I think we have some more sales yeah I know 62 cards sold yeah, this builder guy, 
and we had some more uh, division rival master cards sell here somewhere. Yeah, some Evans here. Another 106 card. Some 99s, I think also for like 400k or something that I that I put on. And that's it. Okay, so we can actually... Let's just get those last cards here. As the only cards left here then are silvers that I'm going to have to dismiss. So we are... Yeah, okay, we are at 52 million coins. So that's... It was a good guess, man. 45 to 50 million. Well, well, well guessed, Amin. Um... And with these 50 million now we can upgrade our skill boost. So let's upgrade box to box um, from Henderson and Gullet here to level 32. 32, that's awesome. And we are actually not that far away from level 33. Uh, we can upgrade Buffon skill boost to level 31. And I am seeing that I still have 31,000 coins. I still think I'm going to up, uh, get the 50,000 skill boost offer from the flash sale. Um, 12,500 gems uh, for 50,000 skill boost. So we get uh, goalkeeper all rounder skill boost also to level 32, which is nice. Uh, we can upgrade Ronaldo's long shot skill boost, uh, but only to level 31, I think. Okay. As it still impre uh, increases 1% uh, long shot and 1% cross, which is good. And one more skill boost is tackling. I think it's from Van Dijk here. Perfect. So we got Van Dijk also. That still leaves us with 26 million coins. Uh, let's go into flash sale and get the third um, offer here of the skill boosts. Let's go into flash sale here. Yeah, 50,000 skill boost for 12,200, uh, 12,500 gems is a good offer if you ask me. As you can see, you can buy this pack three times. There's a limit to it. We've already claimed it um, twice. Uh, we're going to claim it a third time now. I do want to try to get as close to skill boost maxing level 35. Won't be possible as possible, uh, as close as possible. As we do get box to box, which is good because box to box... Yeah, we can increase it to level 33, which is nice. Uh, let's just see um, what else we can improve here. I hope it's just more than box to box. Let's go back to our... Yeah, we can upgrade four skill boosts. That's amazing. So those 50,000 skill boosts did pay off. We can upgrade Captain. We can upgrade... That's four cards. That's awesome. So captain's now at 31 as reaction and um, tackling increases by 1%, which is good. Uh, we can even upgrade box to box to level 33. That's amazing. So it's really nice how many skill boosts you can actually get now at this time of the season here. Um, how much uh, skill boost EA is giving because it does improve uh, and go for your OVR, as we can even improve dribbling to level 32 here. Grealish and Bale, it's very nice. And we are now shy of coins. So, uh, goalkeeper, we are missing 1.4 million coins for upgrading Buffon. Um, nevertheless, we did increase our OVR to 222, so we got an OVR increase of two by upgrading the skill boosts. And what I will do is I'm going to just list my, some of the cards here now. Because um, as you as you see, okay, I've got most master cards uh, in. But let's just maybe try to get 1.4 million coins for the time being. Uh, so is there any suggested price for Sonuku? No. For DiMarco? No. So let's just list them for, let's say... 750k, I'd be happy if I get 750 at this time for them. Um, yeah, and we can list, we can list the, 
uh, rivalries card for, for 200k. Hey Frozen Connie, what's up? How are you doing my friend? Welcome to my stream. Okay, then yeah, I mean I'm gonna list I'm gonna list uh, some of these division rival gold cards, just one each if they sell. I'm going back to them and to uh, check out their suggested price. Just sell one of each, and if one sells, then the, we might catch a spike. You're a bit late, but it's okay. Uh, you sold some Foda sitting on your bench. Nice, okay. Uh, you finalize your team. Okay, we can take a look at that. I'll just list all of my one card of 79 and 78 each. Um, maybe we'll get some sales in during the stream, would be quite nice. As then, we are still missing 1.5 million coins to upgrade uh, one more skill boost. We claimed uh, around 52 million coins, I think it was. A little less because I had like 5 or 6 million coins before. So we claimed like 45 to 50 million coins from, from sales. I still have a lot of cards here, as you can see. Um, probably like over 1,500 cards that I still have to just dump and sell. Uh, and just convert into coins. Um, and and we did increase our OVR now to 222. So that's good. As we do, do get a sale already. Let's... Okay, so I'm just gonna finish here with the 79s and let's just see who sold. A good investment is uh, Goretzka. Definitely, yeah. We checked out Goretzka uh, before. Uh, because you could snipe him for like 2.3 million and he is selling for almost 5 million. Uh, definitely a good investment. Uh, for me, the time of investment is over uh, in the season. I have enough cards. I just have to sell my cards and turn them into coins. Uh, because all I'm going for at the moment now is um, skill boost upgrades. Uh, I'll just show you my team here. It's basically just all maxed out at 120. Uh, we still haven't done any rank upgrades, yeah? So if you take a look here, for example, uh, my if you go to rank upgrades, I have plenty of shards, yeah? 658 uh, legendary shards. So probably next stream, we will start with uh, upgrading ranks of players. Uh, that's why I'm still going to need like another 100 million coins for that. Shouldn't be a problem in the next days. Uh, like I said, I, I generate around 50 million coins the last three days. So uh, within the next week, uh, I should I should then also be done with rank upgrades. As we are still going for, uh, I can show you on my second division. We have uh, alternative players here. Uh, Trippier is going to make my main team. I'm going to have to transfer, not transfer his ranks, but train him to 120 and transfer Bale's ranks to 120 into my main team. But at the moment, we're shy of coins for that because I was uh, mainly focusing on skill boost, which we have between level 30 and 33 now, which is good. Let's just see who sold. The last card down. Like I said, I, all of these are silvers that I'm just going to have to relist them. I'm listing them for like 20 to 30k. Might have to go down to like 10 to 20k, just dumping prices, just to get rid of them. There's no need more, no, no more need for any silvers here. Okay, we are 111 cards sold, that's nice. As we have 5.4 million, but I think we need 5.5 million for the skill boost upgrade, or? Or do we need 6 million? Now we need 6 million, so we need another 600,000 coins more. Maybe we'll be able to get that during the stream, if not, not such a, a big of a deal. Um, yeah, let's take a look at Frozen Connie's team. Uh, he said he is, it's his final team now. You're still upgrading on skill boost. Yeah, me too. It's a, it's an ongoing process. Uh, I want to get a skill boost as high as possible. Uh, my goal was a couple months ago or weeks ago to get to level 30. Uh, but now seeing that we get so many skill boosts from in-game, yeah, with, with perk points, with star shop. Uh, always in star shop, go for the 800 daily skill boosts, yeah. That, that you can really uh, make and push up your, your skill boosts high, which makes a difference. So, Frozen Connie, 189, 540. You said this is your final team. Okay, 424 formation. That's a nice uh, versus attack formation, especially. So, you've got Trippier in already. You've got Vidic. You really want to keep Vidic, though? 
I mean, he's a nice icon card, but 110 pace is a bit, bit problematic, I think. Jordi Alba, Varane is very nice. De Gea is nice. Goretzka, Henderson, awesome. Um, Sancho is off position, just so you know. Uh, maybe you want to get a right forward card. Um, whoops, let me go back. Ronaldo, Mbappé, awesome up front. Ronaldinho up as a left wing is also decent. I mean... If you want to take your team to next level, I would pref I would suggest that you get um, Griezmann for Ronaldinho, um, and you get a right forward. But De Gea, Mbappe, Ronaldo, Goretzka, Henderson, Trippier, Varane, and Jordi Alba are end game. So my suggestion is, if then change, maybe uh, definitely change Vidic. Uh, Change Sancho for a white right winger that's in position. Maybe get Bale. Yeah, do the Bale SBCs and put in Bale for Sancho. Uh, change Vidic and perhaps change. I mean, Ronaldinho is fine and he's a legend. And I love this guy. But if you do check out FIFA renders, you will see that ultimate uh, top transfer Griezmann is uh, a bit better than than Ronaldinho. But nevertheless, nice team. Uh, very. I, w I would rate it like 9, nine out of 10, definitely. Maybe even 9.2 out of 10. Bale is too expensive for you? You mean for the for the SPCs here? I mean, it depends. If you don't have that many players, then you have to buy them. Then it is expensive. For me, it wasn't that expensive because I had most of the players already in stock and I've invested uh, during the season. So, uh, but but... If, if you can, I mean, season's still running for a couple weeks, then I would definitely try to go for Bale. Okay, uh, and what else can we do? Um, let's go into... You know what? We can open two Beckham packs. Let's open two Beckham packs. I've saved some points here. And if we're lucky, we actually do get some coins. Uh, Beckham packs, you can see here I have 250 points, so let's open two Beckham packs. I mean, I prefer 400 skill boosts to be honest, because the coins are anyways going to come in the next days. Ah, 275,000 coins. I mean, ideally you want to get a player, because these Hernandez and Fati are probably worth more than a couple hundred thousand mm -hmm. coins at this time of the season, because they are quite rare card would be ideal a player card which we can ah okay but we get 80 johnson i don't know how much he's worth let's just check on the market um maybe we can get a couple hundred k mm -hmm. for him but i doubt it 80 johnson from beckham Four hundred seventy thousand. uh is there any for under three hundred thousand? Yeah, look, 120, 126, okay, so not not a good pull here, are there any for under 120, yeah, we can list him for, for 120, he should, he's selling for 113, uh, 80 card here, suggested, what's his offer, look, 47 suggested, so let's just put him on for, for 120, uh, minimum 100, and let's see if he sells. What happened to my gems? I spent them on the 50k flash sale skill boost offers. Um, here, we got three times 50,000 skill boost. Uh, the third time today, the first two in the other streams, but we claimed... we. It's not even here anymore. You see 5,000, 20,000. Um, once, you, once you claim this pack here three times, it's, it's done and over with. As I might still then go for, for 20,000 skill boosts. But we have now gotten uh, 50,000 skill boosts before in this stream. And we have now, if you can see, our, our skill boosts uh, leveled up to level 31 to, to 33, which is quite nice. As we can upgrade goalkeeper skill boost if we are getting 300, 300, how much do we need? 313,000, 312,000 uh, coins more. So definitely, maybe it'll come in this stream. If not, then then I'm going to upgrade that skill boost next stream. 
but level 33, 31 is, is quite decent. I'm uh, quite happy with that free to play. Uh, let's go into our daily grind here. In the SBC event, you can get skill boosts. Yeah, I mean, obviously, I've done that already. Like, you can get tons of skill boosts in the Icon Strikes SBCs here. Um, I can show you that if you go here to Ruhmshalle. Uh, we can claim Icon Strike points, actually. Uh, just do these all of these SBCs, yeah? You get a lot of skill boosts. I think it's like 40, 50,000. Icon Strikes SBCs, as you can see, they're all completed. 600 skill boosts here, 800 here. Uh, a 92 player SBC gives you a thousand skill boosts. And there are a shitload of players and skill boosts that you can get here. And obviously the, the league matchups, uh, kit SBCs here. If you go to SBCs, um, I'm not done with all of them, but I have done most of the league uh Kit SPCs. Uh, I still have to do the big leagues here. Premier League, League, uh, Italy League. Because uh, those are the most expensive ones, yeah. Spanish League, German League. But but all of the small leagues, as you can see here, I'm, I'm basically done. Uh, Polish League, I only have a couple more to do. I've started those. And Swedish League. Otherwise, from the small leagues here, they're all done. And you do get 25 S skill boosts. Every time you do one, it doesn't sound like a lot, but it does add up and it makes makes sense to to upgrade there for, for skill boost. And obviously in the star shop every week you, you or sorry, every day you can get 800 skill boosts here. Yeah, so we are still going to claim 800 today, but we do still have to grind our uh, daily division rival stuff here for that. Uh, play head-to-head? -head? Uh, maybe. I mean, I haven't played head-to-head -head that much. As you can see, I've dropped in the weekly leaderboard to position 28. Head-to-head, -head, we are at uh, 1.4 something million fans. Uh, I have been grinding mainly here league matchups lately. Uh, yeah, just played the head-to-head. -head. This is still from yesterday, from uh, the daily gift here, um, from, from last reset. A uh, couple losses here, unnecessary, uh, but uh, all, everything that you see here, the win with zero fans increases from, from league matchups. Um, yeah, a couple, couple unnecessary L's here, too many reds, um, more, more losses than I, I wanted, but nevertheless, uh, 1.4 something million fans, uh, globally in the leaderboard at 627. Uh, how much? How far is top 250 away at the moment? Uh, you need at the moment almost 1.6 million fans to get into 250. So that'll be a challenge, yeah, because we are like over 150,000 fans away from that. So that's like 10, 10, 12, 10 to 12 consecutive wins. Uh, I'm, I am going for top 250. Uh, it is a goal of mine because I really do want to have that badge for next year. Uh, nevertheless, that's going to be very tough. But I still think 628th on the global leaderboard is a decent position. I mean, if you think about, let's say, FIFA Mobile has, let's just say, around the curve, around the thumb, educated guess, 50 million downloads. From these 50 million downloads, I'd reckon that there are like 5 million casual players. Let's say there are like 500,000 active players, or let's just say 600,000. Uh, we are still here in the top 0.01%, yeah, so that's quite an accomplishment. Uh, but nevertheless, I am striving for, for higher here with at least to get to FIFA uh, superstars this time, as, as I have always been missing it out lately quite closely. Uh, I can show you that on my profile. Last season, we were at like 1.8 million fans. And I think the season before we were at 1.868 million fans. So never made FIFA Master, uh, FIFA Superstars. Uh, definitely going for that uh, here since this is the last season uh, before reset. Um, you choose coins. Okay, I mean, no need really to choose coins. You can make coins on the market. I just suggest you go for skill boost. You can make theoretically infinite amount of coins on the market. So for me, skill boost is the more wiser thing to go for 
Okay, so let's continue with our versus attack grind here. Uh, what are the requirements for today? Um, 10 curl goals, 10 assists, 3 wins. Okay, and if we get to 1.15 million, we actually get 300 more skill boosts. Let's see if that's possible. So as we get a 216 OVR team should be beatable as we have now increased our OVR to 222 from 220. GG, nevertheless, he has a good team and a good formation. That's not too hard of a challenge. No, it should, should be doable. So Ronaldo, Curl, okay, 1-0. We also have to do some assists, so assist with a curl, ideal. Hitting two flies with one stone, let's pass it, let's curl it. There we go, 3-0. Is there any support here? No, so Ronaldo will have to take that shot by himself. Goal it, there's the assist. Ah, there wasn't a curl shot though. Free kick. So 6-2, that should already seal the win here. Oh, nice save with a bicycle kick here in defense. Again, very nice save here from the keeper. Uh, not ideal, the, the corner here was uh, crossed too uh, centrally here to the goalkeeper. Not, not playing my best here, but nevertheless, it should be a very... Comfortable win here, 7-3 at the moment. He's not going to be able to catch that up in 15 seconds. Five goals. Uribe. There we go. So let's make it two digits here by scoring the 10th goal with Gullit. And let's try to score another goal here with an assist and a curl from Gullit again. Uh, can you use Burton Albion kit? Uh, I think I have Burton Albion, but I use uh, my favorite team's kit, Rapid Wien, Rapid Vienna. But yeah, I mean, I can show you. Uh, you can get any kit you want here from the squad building uh, league kit challenge. So if you want a Burton Albion kit, Burton Albion, do they play Premier League or Championship? I'm not sure, to be honest. Let me just check. Burton, I think they... Brighton, yeah, Brighton plays in Championship. I always get those mixed up. And championship, I think, is Burton Albion, or? Bristol, Cardiff, no. Where, where does Burton play, actually? FIFA Ruben raids with 45 people. Amazing. FIFA, thank you. Ruben, thank you so much for this raid. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, welcome, guys. Big shout out to Ruben. Huge raid here. Thank you very much, guys, for, for the raid. So Ruben, I hope you had a cracking stream. Welcome to my stream, guys. So like I said, if you wanna, if you want um, a jersey here uh, from from any team, your favorite team, just do the league kits. And um, if you're unlucky, you have to do them 18 times because every kit that you get here is uh, random. But nevertheless, um, you can you can do those, yeah. So let me catch up on the on the stream here. We got a 45 people raid here. That's amazing. Guys, thank you so much for, for being here. I really appreciate Ruben for, for you raiding my stream. Absolute legend here. You lost over 10 million coins to get Burton Albion? I mean, generally the the leak kit SPCs are cheap. Uh, only the only ones that are a little more expensive are are the main leagues like Premier League, uh, Spanish main first league, German Bundesliga. But but the other league kits are quite quite easy as you just need eleven seventy plus players. So hello guys, hello everybody, welcome to my stream. Catch up on the chat, man. Chat is running so quick. Uh, do kids carry over? Yes, kids carry over. 